when we are on the path of devotion the life light of this path turns our devotion god centered our existence will be considered intense and mature if our feelings and emotions become both the basis and purpose of our existence for the love of god pandit shri ram sharma acharya ji book name bhakti pad ki jeevan gatha fundamentals of path of devotion book introduction absolute devotion lies in seeing oneness in this world where we consider everyone our own this is the end result of bhakti if we learn to see this oneness gradually all the ever separation corruption crime jealousy hatred etc will finish the more we have faith in god the more we are blessed with their powers and love when practiced in the world the same love brings cooperation and love to us from all directions as we develop in devotion our desire to get this love increases love is different to the attachment love just believes in giving love fills our hearts with good qualities and good thoughts by worshiping god we are trying to develop our capacity to love as this capacity increases the boundaries start to diminish and we can see oneness in all few excerpts from the book devotion means love you start this by loving god as he is the one you should be loved the most being the only one worthy of infinite love love is considered nectar as wherever it is spreads it makes it beautiful difficulty in bhakti yoga is that an individual needs to be pure genuine and completely spiritual If we address to this then bhakti devotion is result oriented else not In reality god can not be perceived by senses he can be felt by our inner self If you want to know god you have to start experimenting with love a little light of this fills ourselves with good qualities We should love god who is the reservoir of high ideals doing this will help us mold in a frame that we will also become like him Our mind takes us on a destructive path naturally. It also is not ready to accept any rules and regulations. In this situation people become pessimistic and think that we cannot overcome our bad habits. But if we stir the emotion of love in our hearts, we can overcome all these difficulties. Our mind is slave of love. If we use the power of love, then we can persuade it to walk on a desired path. Love is the spiritual secret of human life. and growth in life depends on our emotion of love few topics covered in the book higher emotions are the basis of personality development god sees our feelings follow bhakti mark for development of oneness feelings principles of bhakti mark 